All right, guys. So we're gonna we're gonna watch a video um, recorded by Andrew Tate. So Andrew Tate uh, spoke about in this video, in this presentation, it spoke about how the the Babylon, you know, uh, I mean the way you like to call it, the Matrix. All right, the Western government, how they use information, how they use media, you know, uh, TV news. To control people, you know, because the more they control you and the less resistance they're going to have from people, you know what I'm saying? So they want you to think in a certain way. They want you to believe certain stuff. So you don't have to question them. And when they take decisions, for example, decisions like uh, invading Iraq, decisions like uh, starting a war, Decisions like, uh, you know, put a lot of crazy stuff in your mind about Africa's poor. Um, there's only poor people in Africa. There's nothing in Africa. Uh, don't go to Africa. Don't visit Africa. You know, stuff like that. So Andrew Tate actually is currently in jail right now. They accuse him of fake uh, rape. Uh, there's no proof. There's no evidence of him um, raping anyone or um, the accusation of uh, human trafficking too because since he start talking about the way we're supposed to be thinking the way uh, human beings supposed to be thinking uh, the way we're supposed to question everything governments say to us everything we see on the news the way we're supposed to uh, Make sure not to believe everything they tell us the way it is, but always be able to question, ask questions, you know what I'm saying? Challenge them. So they have to prove stuff to you before you believe them. That's why it's very important for you not just to believe anything you see in the news, because the news, all these big medias, big news companies, you know what I'm saying, corporations, they work together with the government, they work together with uh, uh, these big institutions to keep deceiving you, to keep lying to you, and because they want you to keep being poor. They want you to stay poor. They don't want you to explore your ability to create wealth for yourself. They don't want you to understand how the, the world works, how you can uh, be financially independent, how you can be able to... Uh, um, you know, be be at the um, highest level, you know what I'm saying, explore new things, you know what I'm saying, and travel and get to know the truth about life. All right. So let's listen to the to Mr. Um, Andrew Tate, what he said in this video. And then we um, I, I want to hear you guys opinion, what you guys think about it. All right. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. You know what I'm saying? Do me a favor. Subscribe to this channel. So you can help me grow, you know what I'm saying? So you can help me, you know, reach a list. Uh, I'm, my goal is to reach 20,000 followers, I mean subscribers, uh, right here on YouTube. Also, you can, uh, you're going to see a link where you can follow me on Facebook and you can follow me on Instagram as well. Help me reach that goal and um, I count on you, every one of you. Thank you very much, you know, keep watching and I'm going to keep bringing some nice stuff to you, to you guys, all right? Um, everything I wish you guys all the best. The world is influence. It's always been about influence. Pitch battles in which armies go to war with machines of death and destruction is about nothing more than influence. Controlling the land to influence it. To tell them what language to speak. Tell them what currency to use. Tell them who to vote for. It's always been about influence. The battle for control, the battle for information, people think it's a small one. Oh yeah, they control the information, but it doesn't matter, it's just a website. No, because the information influences you. And battles for influence are the only reason there's been battles since the dawn of human time. We're now living in a world where there is endless battle ongoing for your mind. They're trying to control what you see. If they control what you see, they can control what you think, and they can influence you. Once they can influence you, they can control you. Every single thing that exists out there inside of the matrix is done so with a purpose. They don't give you the news for free because they want you to be informed. They give you the news for free because they want you to watch it so they can tell you what to think. Every class you learn in school, 
Every TV program you watch, every website you find, all of them are created to keep your mind inside of a box. Because by keeping you inside of a box, they can keep you broke. And when they keep you broke, you must adhere to society's rules and laws, even if you know they're unfair, so you have enough money to eat. This is how they control you. When I talk about the matrix and escaping it, when I talk about the real world, I'm not talking just about being able to give you real information. I'm not talking about a system which exists completely outside of the matrix, our own servers, our own banks, our own payment processors, our own constructs that prevent the matrix from shutting us down. I'm also talking about a way for you to earn money in ways they don't tell you. When's the last time you've sat with any of the matrix approved systems, any school, any TV program, any financial planner, and they told you exactly how to make money. They don't tell you that because once you're rich, you're free. And this is why they cannot have you earning money. This is why you must stay inside of your fucking box. This is the whole point of all of it. The real world is something that I have built. It's something I was planning for a very long time. And after they canceled me, I accelerated my plans. The real world uses its own servers hidden beneath the mountain. Armed guards defend them. The real world has its own processing power, its own banks. The real world cannot be shut down. It cannot be censored. It cannot be stopped. They cannot tell me what I can say. The information is truly free. And this is how I will teach you how to make money in ways you have never heard of before, never seen before, and will never find access to these tools and this information anywhere else on the planet. We're in the middle of a cultural shift. One of the biggest mistakes they ever made was banning me. This annoyed God because God knows the truth in my heart. He knows I do not lie. God is on my side. Elon now has control of Twitter and is opening up people's minds to free information. Meta as a company is tanking. Mark Zuckerberg went from the third richest man in the world to the 29th richest man in the world. YouTube stock is down. Rumble, where I am, the stock is up. People are starting to understand if you want the truth, you have to go to other platforms, and other platforms are starting to prosper all across the internet. Information is becoming free again. Influence is diversifying. The matrix is cracking. And if you want to escape, I'm waiting for you inside of the real world.